abate, ongoza baga mkubake, okute, oma konza. Kutuga ni ngami wali tambo la semzi. Ninena vele nyange mtualo wa wamamba. Oma vela, ni ngazi itiban, indala ewi. Ama butoka ngoza ka kokobi, avele mshabe mpesho ya gomlambo uzi nyati. Ungoza ka kokobi, ukokobela inkomo za matoto. Kapela kala ibala lam. Oyo wadi chonga, kapela ela kogi. Oyo wa sonja le kupela uchu umoya wa. Umoya oka kaya nguma inyani shoba zam. Jika kanja la ingo ndenga na mwono. Inga kaya. Tele sbinde zipanda nguwa. Oyo wa konda nga ngondo. Wa tinga nga mkobo. Pum. Tired of the creative bankruptcy that was my life, I quit my job as a junior editor in Johannesburg, South Africa and moved to Florence, Italy to do my honours in studio art and to hopefully find myself. Instead, I'm making it. So I'm gonna do a cross the mold of my face. Either, well, next, next week, probably. Um, Tuesday or Thursday. And then, um, so it will be my face and then the water all around, but freestanding. So I you can see, like, vertical? Yeah. At the beautiful town of Pisa. I believe we walked here. I was tricked. <laughs> with a sensory explosion of art, churches, food, colors, and filthy, beautiful cobblestone streets. The reality of my situation hit fast. I just got news that one of the people I was depending on a bursary for might not come through. And the other one is looking a bit unhopeful. So I am in a foreign country not knowing what the hell I'm going to do if these people don't come through. So my life right now is made up of a whole lot of uncertainty. I'm uncertain whether I'll get funding. I'm uncertain whether I'll be able to finish this film. If I'll fin be able to finish school. Not even sure why I came here in the first place. 
But the show must go on, so I put on the performance of my life, swallowing my fear of being thrown off this proverbial Florentine stage and getting on with it. Anxiety brimmed and all. Hungry. Please look at what they are exhibiting right now. Lambe. Lunch. <laughs> Lunch. I will show you. It's bread. I want the bread. See, I'm being into him. Ah. It feels weird when I speak closer here. It feels like I'm trying to like force it. it. Feels very out of place. I can tell you that. When they're full and you know, to just close. If you are not if it's close, and that's not like a sieve now, but I'm trying to see if it's close. Right now, it's so close to December, and I still don't know what's going on. I just I've been calling places, you know, for funding. I'm trying to keep hopeful, but it's so late in the year for me not to know still what's going on. It's, it's so unnerving because I have so much work to do and things to concentrate on and I can't because there's this lingering thing of, will I be here next semester? Am I doing all of this for nothing? I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired of pouring my heart into nothing. I feel like I'm filling in a bucket of water, but the bucket has holes at the bottom. No matter how hard I try to fill it, it does not get full. I'm just tired. I just want things to go forward. I just want to go forward. I feel like I'm a standstill in everything. Like I'm in this vacuum where I can't move or breathe or anything. And I just, I'm just tired. I just wish I knew the way that it was clear. And I wish I knew who I was and what I was doing. I mean, I do ridiculous things to people I care about that I can't explain. Things I know I shouldn't be doing, but I do them anyway. And I'm tired of being a hypocrite to myself. I'm tired. I'm tired of always asking myself, why? Why did you do that particular thing? Or why did you behave in that way? I just want to know who I am. I'm tired of searching, and I know I'm going to search forever, but... It feels like my plates are always shifting underneath me and there's always an earthquake of eruption all the time. I just want it to be stable around me, just to be stable. Yeah. 
all endless. Look at that. Infinite chances, infinite disappointments, infinite. How splendid the impression we created. You're all about keeping up appearances, but you're not fooling anybody. You are not powerful. You have no power. You're just like the rest of us, scrambling to survive. You are not on a pedestal. You are not anything. The world does not revolve around you and your ideals. What is right, what is good, what is pure. No, that is not how the world works, okay? You know what you are? You're a prostitute. That's exactly what you are. I feel sorry for you. The fact that you had to kill and destroy so much just so you feel important. I'll mourn for you. Uh, I just got an email from the dean saying he wants to see me urgently. I know obviously what it's about, but I'm nervous. I don't want to go, <laughs> but I can't be nervous. Oh, I don't know. I just have a bad feeling. Well, I'm scared obviously because I don't have a solution to the problem as yet. So I don't know what I'm going to tell him when he asks me. So what do we do now? I'm a little nervous, of course. My head will catch up with Come to the end of my journey here. With a $60,000 debt, the school could no longer afford to carry me. It's over. It's over. Class, we're stopping to, to go home. Read the, the email, yeah. So this is good. You'll sleep better tonight, I'm sure. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the news. Absolutely, thank you. I mean, you've been great about the whole thing. A lot of other, other students would have taken it um, really not so well and, and, and wouldn't have been so understanding of our position, too. And uh, you've been great throughout. So I think we just work together and we'll resolve it. And uh, happily, uh, it looks very much like you'll be able to stay with us and uh, complete your uh, uh, certificate program this year. <laughs> the same day I got kicked out of school, a sponsorship I'd been chasing for 10 months finally came through. You know, there's a, a certain finesse in always being a victim of circumstance because it, 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 it warrants attention that you didn't necessarily attract on purpose. Do you understand what I mean? And I'm tired of, of that. I just am in a place right now where I want to accept it.
Thank you.